This week's parasha contains the pasuk that, that is the source for the idea of Baal Tashlis, that you're not allowed to destroy something. So it says, Ki Adam The Torah tells us in Parachaf, Pasuk Yud Tes, in verse 19, that when a person, when an army goes out into battle, you're not allowed to cut down a fruit-bearing tree. And the reason is because it is a tree of the field like a man that can defend itself and protect itself. You can't cut down a tree. That's the literal way to read it. But the Bali Musar, they don't read this as a question. Ki hadam is a tree is a tree of the field like a man, but rather they read it as a statement that man is like a tree of the field. Ki hadam man is like a tree of the field. Ravolbi in, in in talking about it from a perspective of Musar says it means that just like a, a seed, a tree has a seed, and that seed contains the blueprint for the greatness of the tree. The tree will blossom and produce the most beautiful leaves and fruit. So too, a person, when we're born, we're just a seed, and it's our responsibility to take out our potential and serve Hashem. And we have to remind ourselves during the month of El that what we are capable of, that we are like a seed of a, of a tree, that we're capable of just producing such beauty and, and greatness. The Lubavitcher Rebbe says also along the same vein, but the Lubavitcher Rebbe says in, in, in the Lubavitcher Rebbe's way that that a person is like a tree, in the sense that a tree is always rooted to the ground, and it's worse, and it's our responsibility to grow and to mature slowly and slowly, and to produce fruit to serve the world. A, a barren tree is allowed to be cut down, but a tree that produces fruit for the world and and is giving to others, that's a tree that we're supposed. That's what a man is supposed to be like, like a tree that produces fruit and serves the world and gives to the world while it stays rooted to its source which is the earth.